Well, the 1st of April brings with it the return of orange barrels to I-75 in Saginaw County. Starting today, the Michigan Department of Transportation will have an ongoing presence on the Zilwaukee Bridge in the surrounding area. NBC 25's Josh Marshall is in Zilwaukee, where signs of change are warning drivers. Josh? Bill, MDOT spent today putting up signs letting drivers know that Interstate 75 Zilwaukee Bridge southbound is closed and that traffic's being detoured to Interstate 675. It's about a two-mile difference in distance, but drivers say that it's still a headache. Pain in the butt. The Michigan Department of Transportation is reconstructing four miles of Interstate 75 and replacing bearing pads along expansion joints on the Zilwaukee Bridge. We really want to make sure we maintain the structural integrity of the Z Bridge and all of our bridges. We have an aging infrastructure we're dealing with. MDOT says dwindling funding is making construction a tough task to accomplish. A tough task even for drivers. You can't get around and slow. Traffic's bad. Southbound Zilwaukee Bridge construction is scheduled to continue through January 2014 and complete construction through 2015, racking up a total investment of $36 million. We're going to be replacing all of the bearings along the bridge. We're also going to be doing some road improvements from the James Road Bridge north to the I-675 junction. MDOT says overall the project will maximize the service life of the bridge, helping MDOT work towards their goal. It's our job at MDOT to make sure that the roads are in good condition for Michigan residents and for those who are traveling through the area. Construction on the Z Bridge began in 1979 and it wasn't completed until nine years after that, meaning that in its 26 years of open service, this construction project alone is about half of the original $79 million budget proposed to build it. Live in Zilwaukee, Josh Marshall, NBC 25.